You don't need to go to the priest. You don't need to go to confession. You don't need to do all these religious things. You just need to simply trust in Jesus. Jesus didn't come for a religion. He came for a relationship. What matters more than your church attendance is do you love God? Because many people go to church, but they don't love God. Many people, they, they say a prayer before a meal, but do they really love God from their heart? Because Jesus said the greatest commandment, the greatest commandment is to love the Lord your God with all thy heart, all thy soul, and all thy mind, and to love your neighbor as yourself. The message of the Bible. People ask, what's the Bible about? What's this whole book about? Why is this book the most famous book in the world? What's it really all about? It's all about love. It's all about love. That's what the Bible's about. The most purchased book in the world. Also the most stolen book in the world. Which is kind of crazy. Why would people steal a book that tells you do not steal? But they're trying to smuggle Bibles in so that people can get it to other countries. The Bible's spreading throughout the whole world. What's this book all about? It's about Jesus. It's about a man who knew no sin, who became sin, so that in him we could become right with God. It's about love. It's about God pursuing you when you wanted nothing to do with him. He wanted everything to do with you. It's about God laying down his life and retrieving you and pulling you out when you were drowning, when you were dead in your trespasses and sins, following the prince of this world, the course of the power of the air, the living in the flesh. God was rich in mercy. And even when we were dead in our trespasses and sins, he made us alive together with Christ. And by grace, we've been saved through faith. And it's not of yourselves, it's a gift of God. Not by works, so no one can boast.